Hi, my name is Matt. And I'm John. And we're the owners of Old Coast Ales in St. Augustine, Florida. I started brewing with kits a few years ago, and um, John helped with bottling and, and uh, with the brewing. And in very short order, we realized that we wanted to expand that to all grain brewing. And so we've been doing that for a couple of years now. As we started brewing more and getting more familiar with different beers, then that's when we kind of thought that maybe we can make this thing work. We have such a passion for brewing the beer that that's something we could bring to the people here in St. Augustine. Um, well, St. Augustine is the perfect place for a craft brewery. Um, the millions of tourists that we have visiting, the international feel, the, we're surrounded by water. It's just a the fantastic setting, the oldest city in the United States. Um, just one thing that's missing is a local craft brewery and tap room. I think our concept for our microbrewery here in St. Augustine is much different than what we have around us. What we're interested in doing is really pulling in the community and the locals and just making a really great place for everyone to hang out and just have a really great fresh pint of locally made beer. What we'll be using these funds for is equipment. Uh, that's the largest portion of the cost in opening a brewery. And so the equipment we've been looking at is a mash tun and brew kettle out of a company in Colorado. In addition, if we receive more funds, we'll be using them for fermenters and other equipment that's necessary to open the brewery. Yeah, and really that's just a, a really small percentage of the equipment that we actually need to take beer from grain to glass. We're talking glycol chillers, cold room, equipment, kegs. We need kegs, we've got to have a place to put that beer, so that's where your funds will come in. Mom, what are you drinking? You're drinking I got the porter. porter. It's dark and rich and like a good earthy flavor, it's smooth, not too bitter. Awesome. 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 Megan, you got the Saison, what do you think of that? It's delicious, it's really light, it's got a little bit of sweetness, it's kind of like the perfect summer beer. Awesome. So Michael, you're drinking our double IPA, what do you think about that one? It's very good, nice and smooth, tastes a bit of caramel, some stone fruit in there. Very, very nice. Can't really taste the alcohol, which I like. Yeah, it covered it nicely at 8.5%. Yeah, yeah, it's really, really, really good. Right, so what are you drinking? I have the uh, Empirical IPA. What do you think about it? Tell me about it. It's incredible. It's just that perfect balance between uh, hoppiness and a little bit of bitterness up front. It yields to kind of a nice, smooth uh, caramel sweetness in the finish. Okay, he's rolling. You got the summer ale. I do. I do. I got it. It's nice. No, I like the hops. You I mean, you guys did a perfect job. So I love the bike. The bike is, I mean, that, that's, that's the ticket right there. Well, the bike's cool, but what about the beer? The beer, that's <laughs> We really have a great local support of local craft beer enthusiasts that really want a microbrewery here in St. Augustine. And that's where you guys come in. And we'd just like to thank you for taking the time to watch our video and follow our journey through making this really a reality. Anything you can contribute will be put to good use. And we want to definitely, definitely welcome you to our brewery. And one of these will be waiting for you. And we'll have a seat for you at the bar. Thanks for watching.